What's going on guys, my name is Aaron or Extra Cosmo and welcome back to another Overwatch video. So today I'm going to be talking about some possible new features that can come to the live Overwatch servers very soon, more specifically crossplay, guilds, clans, whatever you want to call them, and the game going free to play. But before I start off real quick, in two days it will be my one year anniversary since I uploaded my first Overwatch YouTube video, and we also just hit 7,000 amazing subscribers, so for the occasion I want to do a Q&A video, the questions could be anything not just Overwatch related, so go crazy, give me some some good questions in the comments below and also if you're not subscribed yet and you like my videos smash that subscribe button that would mean the world to me all right let's get started now so basically i'm not just pulling these features out of my ass they actually have a lot to do with an interview that was done with the new game director that replaced jeff aaron keller the full interview will be linked in the description but in that interview he said that a large feature that's bigger than anything before is coming to the game soon now obviously we can speculate all we want but that's really all he said this was a few weeks ago, and if you guys don't know, the Overwatch anniversary event is coming up very, very soon, and like the anniversary of the game in general. So I personally think this is when these features are going to be announced, with a little bit of Overwatch 2 info along with it. So to start off with these features, let's start off with crossplay. I think there are an overwhelmingly amount of pros to this decision if it's done right. Keywords done right. If crossplay was implemented, and I'm sure a lot of you know exactly what I'm about to say, PC and console cannot cross boundaries in competitive. I think quick play and especially arcade, PC and console can play with each other. It's good to unite everyone, but me as a PC player wouldn't want a console player on my team, and I bet you if you asked any console player and the people who are watching whose console players and PC players would say the same thing about a PC player on the enemy team. It's just plain unfair, and that's no shame to console. I used to play Overwatch on PS4 like a lot, so it's just a difference in mechanics. It's nothing, nothing harmful. I think the PlayStation and Xbox could 100% crossplay comp though. There's zero negatives coming from that. It's like it improves queue times. There's they're the same skill level. They're both using the same controller. Basic well basically the same controller. But the thing that's hiding in the corner though is the Nintendo Switch. Don't get me wrong, I love the Switch and the more platforms Overwatch is on the better, but I don't think it would fit well with the PlayStation and Xbox communities in competitive. Keyword once again, competitive. Once again, it's just a different mechanic level, but without comp, crossplay is great and if it doesn't get added now and it's an Overwatch 2 feature, it's going to be amazing with PvE, so I'm excited for whatever we get in regards to that. The next possible feature is a guild system. Which could also come along with crossplay in ways so maybe we can get both? <laughs> a guild or a clan system has kind of already been confirmed, so in the screenshot you can see on the screen right now, this is from BlizzCon, they kind of leaked it themselves. You can see it says Clan C9 on the top right of this picture under their name. So how would this clan system work if we got it? I think it would be a lot bigger than we actually think. This most likely would span across all Blizzard games, not just Overwatch, and be crossplay as well. It would really be cool to see something like this, and I hope we get something along the lines of it with the huge update that we keep hearing about but right now that's really all the information i mean i can like make up shit but like i feel like it's useless for you guys to hear so i'm just gonna tell you guys what i know <laughs> Lastly, of these big three possibilities is free to play. And honestly, I don't really have an opinion for this one. Inevitably, it would get more people to play the game and it would do its job, but that's not a question. The problem I have with it is the ridiculous amount of Smurfs. We have a lot of Smurfs now and you have to buy the game. So I don't know how I'd feel about this. People just like getting it for free. Maybe if there was like one phone number per account thing or something that makes it so you can only have one account, but there's just so much you can go into with that. I want to know your guys opinion on that too in the comments below. Do you guys like these features we could possibly get for Overwatch? Let me know in the comments below. Also let me know if you want me to make a features that I want in Overwatch 2 or want in Overwatch 1. It could be anything. <laughs> If you guys enjoyed the video, please drop a like, it helps the channel out a lot, and if you want more gaming content and news, hit that subscribe button and that bell so you can see all my videos when they first come out. Also, if you want a shout out at the end of the video, leave a comment and you can get picked for that. Thank you all very much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.